Ukrainian President, Volodymyr Zelensky, ruled out the possibility of a diplomatic resolution to the war with Putin after Russia annexed the four regions of eastern and southern Ukraine. Russian forces in the Donetsk region were running and panicking on the street as Ukraine pushed to reclaim Moscow-controlled territory in the east of the country. Donetsk, part of the embattled Donbas region of eastern Ukraine, is one of four regions announced as annexed by Moscow at the end of last month. Moscow had held what has been internationally condemned as a set of sham referendums to induct the regions into Russian territory. Russian leader Vladimir Putin then vowed to protect the areas Russia deemed part of its borders, with all the forces and means at our disposal. He added that the regions would, forever, remain part of Russia. He said during the ceremony to formally annex the territories, the people have made their choice. An unequivocal choice. This is the will of millions of people. The UN said the move has no legal value and deserves to be condemned. But Ukrainian forces have worked to press forward in the Donetsk region, forcing Moscow's troops from the strategic town of Lyman and the nearby village of Torsk. Russian troops withdrew from Lyman earlier this month, with the Ukrainian authorities claiming just days later that they had discovered two mass burial sites in the reclaimed city. Ukrainian outlet Ukrainform reported last week that the Russian forces surrendering Lyman and Torsk have been pushed towards the Luhansk city of Kremina. One eyewitness described the terrible occupation of Torsk, where there has been no life since Russian soldiers seized control. The woman, named only as Antonina, told Update M1, but when they left, they were running and panicking on the street. Another woman, described only as elderly, recalled the Russian forces as moving everywhere in their retreat. Serhei Hadai, who heads up the regional administration for Luhansk, said Russian forces had indeed regrouped in Kremina after leaving Torsk and Lyman. Saying that Ukrainian forces had yielded the city, he added, our defenders had to withdraw. They have entrenched themselves in new positions and continue to fight the Russian army. But earlier this week, Hadai said that the occupation of the Luhansk region has begun in a post to his Telegram page. He claimed several settlements had been reclaimed by Ukrainian forces, with the blue and yellow flag now flying in the area. The Ukrainform news outlet added the governor stated Ukrainian forces had reclaimed six settlements in the embattled region, 